Hey, in today's video, I'm going to be doing a quick repair on my Honda Ruckus. Uh, it's a 2012 Ruckus, and the throttle cable uh, was basically stuck on. And so you'd start it up, and it would be idling high and kind of taking off at a stop. You couldn't get the tires to stop. So did some investigation, and I realized I think I need to replace the throttle cable. And probably, I also ordered a, a new throttle grip. So let me walk you through what we have here. So the throttle is here, inside here we'll take this apart. Uh, this is the cable, it runs here, then runs down, runs underneath underneath uh, the gas the gas can where it's bracketed on, and right up to here, and then around to right here. So when you pull the handle, when you pull the grip, it pulls the cable and twists this, which basically is signaling the throttle to inject the gas. So what would happen is, watch when I let go, it doesn't come all the way back. It should pop up right here easily. So that's the return spot. So it kind of gets stuck there, so my suspicion is that the cable's bad. Uh, the cable is probably jammed up in here. This part right here is looking bad, uh, right there. So I went ahead and ordered a new cable. So I got a new cable and a new grip so I'm gonna walk through putting this on I've already taken off the I've already taken off the body panels and and uh, and the foot footboard here so that's pretty straightforward uh, you should be able to figure that out but all right I'm gonna get started I'm gonna walk through it step by step all right first thing I'm gonna do is remove the throttle stop from the throttle control mechanism by the by the right handle grip I'll loosen this and there's two screws under here. If I can get that. Also note there's two different lengths. Okay, so longer ones on this side, shorter ones on this side. So keep track of those. So once you get the top off this bracket, you've got some electrical stuff coming in here. Then you've got the cable coming right here. So the handle is off like this. And the cable comes up right through here and seats in the, in the track on the grip. Okay. So at this point, we should be able to pull that out. I'm going to take the handle off. Okay, looks like that uh, kind of screws on. So let me see if I can un looks like that screws in. Uh, okay, I'm going to reset here. Looks like I need to screw this out. It's set in by a screw. All right, I'm gonna remove the back bracket. There. Get this nut loose. Okay, that gets the cable loose. And slide it out. And then the cable is nestled in like that. So I just pulled the cable out, and that's off the off the mechanism there. See if I can feed this all the way through without taking any of the nuts off. This could be tricky. 
tricky. Lift up that gasket. There we go. There. That gas can is not even held in. It must be held in with the when the footboard and the footrest is in. Okay, so I'm getting that loose. Run the cable up through here. Just gotta get up through there. It's a bit crowded with all these other cables, and I'm trying to do this with one hand. There we go. Okay, getting closer. Okay, now that I've got it here, I can unscrew it. Okay. So that's the old cable out. Now to put the new one back in. So this is a new one. First step, we're gonna slide it up through here. And then we're gonna screw it in. Here's the new grip. The new grip goes on here. And this is nested in. Here, come on this side. Come over to this side. Like that. There we go. Okay. Now we're going to run this through. Coming through there. And then through this hole, there we go. Now we can feed that all the way through. And down. Okay. This goes over here. Up through this bracket right here. See if we can get this through. There we go. And then it's in place, ready for us to hook up. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and hook this. Up before I hook the back on um, so I've got the cable in the throttle pulley you just put the housing over it and there's a little knob on the side here over on this side you got to make sure it, it gets right in the hole on the handlebar okay the longer of the two screws is the front one shorter of the two goes right here on the back side or front side okay so that's working if you look down here as I pull it the cable does move so that means the mechanisms ready to go I'm gonna tighten this nut up here Okay, now on the on the the other end, I'm gonna slide this in the bracket, and then the okay, you got to get this this bracket twisted just at the right angle, and the threads will come through on the other side, just enough for this nut to tighten up on the back side. And then when you pull the throttle, you want to make sure. This returns all the way to this spot right here. It's moving really smoothly. The grip is fresh. Everything pops back into place really nice. 
So I'm gonna start it up, see how the idle is. Perfect idle. That's it. Got a new grip on, new throttle cable replaced. Took me 30 minutes. It was my first time ever doing this, so. If I can do it, so can you. I'm gonna put the panels back on and take it for a ride. One's bright, one's regular. Ooh. Yeah, and it was filming the whole time. Good to know. Hey, babe. Okay, that's it. So fairly straightforward repair. It was my first time doing anything like that, and the only difficulty was it was kind of a tricky, small space to get into, but it works, and the throttle works much better now. The grip is new and fresh. The other one was smooth and worn out. And this throttle is working and popping back real easily. So enjoy.